We're back. Uh, welcome back to AdCast. I'm Carl Vervish, and I'm here with my delightful co-host. Jessica McDonald. I'm glad to last. be delightful tonight. Yes. Delightful to be glad. We're here tonight, uh, right now, this segment, uh, with Heather Christman and Michael Anderson of the Tampa Bay Advertising Federation. Welcome, guys. Hello. Thanks. Appreciate it. Glad to have you on. Tonight, we're going to be talking about Dilly Dali. Uh, great name for a great event. Tell us more about it. Yeah, well, we figured it would be great to do it um, since the conference and the gala and expo is all going to be held in downtown St. Petersburg. And that's the Addy. Of the, yes. yeah, the district Addies? The district Addies. Okay. That's correct. And it's going to be held in downtown St. St. Petersburg. So it's like uh, two blocks away from the Dali Museum. Excellent. So we've got them on board with us. And oh, cool. um, we just thought with the conference itself, we want people to enjoy all the culture and art stuff that's in downtown St. Petersburg. In the creative sure. community. Yeah. Exactly, for all the advertising people. So Great. And there's a gala and an expo and all these wonderful things that are involved with the conference. Tell us more about those efforts. Well, the conference itself is just going to be, it's uh, um, advertising professionals around the state of Florida. And so we wanted to, it's, there are also going to be the um, District Addy Awards, which um, is the best of the advertising creative um, throughout the state of Florida and the Caribbean. And so we wanted to incorporate that as well as um, an expo that uh, Mike can talk about. Yeah, the expo is going to be a fantastic event. It really gives us a chance to highlight all the talent that's in Tampa Bay, uh, you know, from print to video to web and everything else that's in between. And so it just gives us a chance for the local businesses that work with advertising to really promote their business to the entire state of Florida. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be fantastic. Excellent. And I, and I know you know who a lot of the winners were. Were there a lot of Tampa Bay creative shops that, that won Addy Awards this year? Yeah, there were a lot this year. And so we'd like to um, have them come as well, especially since it's in their hometown. Mm -hmm. Sure, yeah. I, I know that, uh, you know, from year to year, a lot of them don't make it down because it's been, what, it's been in Miami the last two years, correct? Miami in the last two years, and then uh, the year before that it was... Um, Orlando. Orlando. Yeah, and none of that's really convenient. Yeah. I mean, especially if you didn't win. <laughs> right. Here, it's yeah. where whether you won or not, it's Just worth go. it to come out to the conference. It's right there, so you know, check yeah. it out, see what it's all about. And yeah, just to see. Hopefully, all after the that, they'll they'll go out of town to see it right, because it is really cool. Just to see really all cool the thing. great creative within the state of Florida sure. and the Caribbean. Yeah, mm -hmm. see what we're doing. You say the Caribbean. What segments, you know, typically do things come from out of the Caribbean? Everything except Cuba. Okay. <laughs> but like, where do we, we typically see Cuba. anything coming out of there? Uh, mainly, you know, I, w I don't want to say mainly because that's stereotyping it, but we get a lot from the from Puerto Rico. I know. I know. Like last year, we had a couple from the Virgin Islands. That did well, so you know, so not a ton, but we do yeah. get some quality creative from mm -hmm. from the Caribbean. Cool, great. And you're both from the Tampa Bay Advertising Federation. Tell us a little bit about your roles. I should have asked that up front, but uh, tell us oh, a sure. little bit about the organization and what you do within the Tampa Bay Advertising Federation. Well, I'm currently the secretary and also on the uh, planning committee for the conference. That was short and sweet. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'm the uh, past president, immediate past president. I was president for two years in a row, uh, so I'm finally done with that. And now I'm monkey boy. Uh, do whatever yes, I tell you to do. Pretty much, yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> so does the Tampa Bay Advertising Federation put on the conference since it's in the area, or? Well, we are planning it. We're the host, um, okay. the host, host club. club for this year. So what's gone into planning an entire event like this? Uh. Can I only imagine? Yes, a lot has gone into planning. Um, uh, you know, first trying to get a, a great committee together, because um, that's that's the main thing, and then just trying to get um, sponsorships and you know get the word out there throughout the state that um, to come register. Great. And I'm sure it's uh, it's not easy either because it's all you know it's all volunteer work. So that's right. Yeah, it's a lot of work. You know, I mean, working with the because you have to work with the district and getting schedules and things oh, like God. that. So, uh, so yeah, I mean, it's, it's a ton of work to coordinate everything with the district and, and the local clubs. And can anyone that's interested attend the conference, or is it mainly for uh, the local advertising community and AdFed members? Well, it's, it's mainly for the members um, within the local clubs, but anybody is allowed to, to come, anyone that's interested in advertising or 
creative or to anything students like even yes yeah, students are definitely welcome part. even students well that's yeah. great to mention at our <laughs> student media oh absolutely sure. yeah we do so have some great speakers co at the uh, conference as well we have right. you know who the speakers are better than i do yeah actually the, um, we're gonna have a keynote speaker on friday her name is uh, sally hogshead she's the author of um, radical careering and then uh, saturday's luncheon is going to be murray gaylord who is the um VP of Marketing at the New York Times oh, online, okay. and he's also the um, American Advertising Federation chairman. Great. Oh, all right. So those are going to be uh, great luncheons to come, speakers to come see during those luncheons, and they're going to be a la carte. Mm -hmm. So anyone that's not coming to the conference can also come to that separately. Okay, great. Okay. And that's May 2nd through 4th is the conference. And that's at the St. Petersburg Downtown Hilton? That's correct. Great. And where can everyone go to find out more information about the event and about uh, your your, your day-to-day goings-on at the Tampa Bay Advertising mm -hmm. Federation? Uh, well, they can go uh, for anything um, on dillydali.com. Mm -hmm. How would you spell that? That's D-I-L-L-Y-D-A-L-I.com. Okay. And they can find anything for um, hotel registration, um, uh, event res registration, the expo if they want to become a, a sponsor or, you know, have a booth there, um, and even just go straight to the um, AdFed website. They can great, and that's tbaf.org. Correct. Yeah, and tbaf.org is a great resource not only for your your general events and what's going on, but it has an excellent job board. So make sure oh, to sure, yeah. check out tbaf.org for all of your advertising needs in the Tampa Bay community. <laughs> So, uh, guys, thank you so much for joining Thanks us. Thanks for coming out. We really appreciate it, and good luck on the event. Thanks. Thank you.